cancelled, I was distraught. I cried for two days straight. One of the quotes that always comes to mind for me is a young person who said, you know, I'm just wondering, will my young adult years all be spent socially distancing? They hope the video will support others in the same situation. Kelly Foran, BBC Northwest Tonight. To sport now and in the FA Cup fourth round, Burnley have just beaten Fulham 3-0. Jack Court crossed the ball for Jay Rodriguez to score the first. Rodriguez got his second from the penalty spot. In the other matches, Manchester United are about to play Liverpool a week on from their goal is draw in the league. Both managers say it's a must-win match. This time around we've uh... We picked one of the favourites and, uh, of course, we know this is a big one uh, if you want to go all the way. United is obviously in a good moment, get all the results they wanted uh, so far and um, that's why we have to be ready 100%. The game is live on BBC One at 5 o'clock while Everton play Sheffield Wednesday in the late kick-off at 8. In Women's Super League, Manchester United beat Birmingham City 2-0. Manchester City thrashed Brighton and Hove Albion 7-1, while Everton's match at Spurs has been postponed. And finally, this is the moment four horses were rescued from floodwaters in Chester Meadows on Friday. The canoeists cut the gate chains to allow them to move towards dry land. Cheshire was hit by flooding after heavy rainfall from Storm Kristoff. The horses are now safe and well, we're told, and are grazing on higher ground. Now, lots of us have seen snow fall across the region today. Let's see if it's going to continue. Here's Kate Forster with the weather. Hello there. Well, some of us saw a little bit more snowfall today. We had a few flurries of snow across southern areas, which gave a covering across parts of Merseyside and Cheshire this afternoon. But it is all clearing away now. It's pushing away to the south and we will be dry for the evening and through tonight. The skies are clearing as well. And under those clear skies, the temperatures are plummeting. So a widespread frost tonight. We could be as low as minus four or minus five degrees. And with that comes the risk of some ice as well. So a bit of slippery first thing tomorrow morning. There will be one or two showers, I think, pushing through for the morning time, but otherwise it's a beautiful afternoon tomorrow. Lots of crisp winter sunshine and it will be a little bit milder as well. Those temperatures reaching a high of around six or seven Celsius. I'll be back just after the 10 o'clock news. Hope you can join me. Good evening.